Morning guys, this is Andrew and um, yesterday didn't really get anything at auction. So this morning uh, we are off again as far as uh, looking for deals. So there is uh, two properties coming up. Um, both properties are really exciting. Uh, not really sure what's going to happen because uh, they have kind of low mortgages that are owed on it. So we're going to go out there and uh, let's see what happens uh, with the the deal hunting with auctions this morning all right talk to you hi guys i'm back and uh, i'm at the property so this is the property uh, stunning property i just went and talked with the uh, owners inside and uh, and basically they're willing to work with us in terms of moving out so this is definitely something that uh, we're going to bid on um, i did uh, make a deal with them as far as cash for keys um, so I'm super excited. I was able to look at the inside. Of course, I could not uh, tape kind of the inside of the property. So uh, I wish I could have recorded it, but I just could not uh, do that since people are uh, living there. But they gave me a nice walkthrough. Just a stunning property. Uh, absolutely, uh, you know, um, in mint condition. So we're going to see kind of what happens uh, here uh, with the auctions. I'm sure there are going to be other people interested in it. Uh, they said nobody else stopped by and they want to work with us so we're going to bid high we're going to bid high so all right let's see hi guys this is andrew so this is the property it's kind of an ugly looking structure the way it is but um so i'm going to go see what the homeowners have to say um this is another one that's coming up for auction today Um, I'm here, ma'am, because uh, this property is coming up for auction today, right? Uh, are you aware of it? Uh, of that? Yeah. You are. Okay. Um, do you know because uh, the company that I work for, uh, they're offering basically the money to the bank, and uh, are you guys planning on moving out? Uh, do you guys have another place to go to? No. Not yet. Okay. Are you guys looking? Uh, until we have the information about the house. Yeah. Right. Okay, got it. Good. Okay. Um, and uh, are you guys interested in renting the property? Uh, we're trying to work it. Okay. So you may be interested in renting it also. Okay, got it. And uh, uh, as far as any water leaks, any issues at all? Yes. And that's why we have concerns about that side. Yeah. Comes through. Come over there? Yes. Okay. So on the on the back side the water comes yeah, through. The I see. Okay. Okay. Uh huh. Six years ago the roof was replaced. But it's not in good condition. Not in good condition. Okay. Besides that, how, how about every, anything else? Uh, okay. Okay. How long have you been here? Nine years. Okay, got it. So this is a three bedroom, two bath, or one and a half bath? It's two bath. Three bedroom, two bathroom. Two full bathrooms. Okay, got it. No problem. My name is Andrew. Uh, what's your name? Roxana. Roxana. Okay, Mr. Roxana. So what I'll do is I'll uh, get back with you, you know, uh, with the paperwork and all that stuff. Uh, uh, like once we get it from the bank, right? Um, and uh, then we can discuss as far as if you guys are interested in renting it. Either way, uh, if we get all the paperwork, we'll fix everything anyways, right? So if you guys want to continue uh, living here, continue renting, we'll would rather deal with you rather than try to evict. And, you know, rather than, it, it's much easier for us and it's okay, easier but, uh, for you. We'll um, see if we have to wait um, for the order from the, I think, from the, judge, from the court. From the court. Yeah, I'll bring you the order. Okay, so, fine. yeah, yeah, so that'll work. All right, Mr. Roxana, thank you so much. Okay. So, if you guys kind of followed the conversation, the whole thing was that uh, basically, um, you know, she wants to see, uh, but looks like they're willing to work. Seems like a really nice lady. So, if we can get the property at the right number, um, hooray, it'll be fun. 
So let's see what happens today. Let's get back to the office and let's start uh, figuring out what the bids should be placed. Go from there. All right, guys. So it's basically, um, it's um, it's kind of after we went and looked at the um, auctions this morning. So I just called uh, Rahul and uh, we're going to kind of go through and uh, we're kind of at the last five minutes. So I called a bunch of people um, that I think will be bidding on these properties because it's always... Uh, tough figuring out who's gonna bid what are they gonna bid and are they gonna basically lie to you or because obviously they don't have to tell us you know what they're gonna bid so uh, Rahul let's first deal with the first property are you there yeah yeah okay so the first property that uh, I want to kind of go through is uh, the property in Stickney okay. so on that one um, it's a really 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 nice ranch and um, I was able to go uh, talk to the owners and it's in mint condition three bedroom two bath property absolutely mint condition uh, so uh, what are you thinking price wise it's, uh, it's one part of a street like just uh, off of Harlem there just off of Harlem two streets over and uh, great 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 property great location so, so if it's a, if it has a basement or not uh, it does have a basement, yes. It should be a good uh, 160, 165 house, right? Right, yeah. Okay. Um, so, yeah, I mean, that's a, so that's a really want, good rental. rental. You want to do a flip. That's a very good rental area. I mean, so if uh, the numbers are 160, 165, um, if we can keep the, keep the project around 100, 10, 115, all in, um, yeah, that area, the rents are quite high, like 1600, 1550, especially if it's a two bedroom, because a bunch of houses in there have one bedroom, and that's always a problem with the family. But three bedroom, two bath is a, is a perfect setup, um, and you'll get 1600 rent easily on that. Yeah, so I called a bunch of guys, and they're thinking around uh, bidding, like already in the 90s, uh, 92, 94, 96, kind of in that price range. Uh, what, are you, what are you thinking? Uh, um, to go up to sure. just let me let me go through this uh, I just want to keep it uh, like emotion take it away so I just want to just look at the numbers just make sure that numbers are telling me the right thing so I'm just going through this uh, uh, the calculator which we normally use for the auction just give me a second uh, let me just go through some of the numbers uh, you know how, how much are taxes there taxes are high taxes are 5500 5500 okay yeah. so roughly 400 a month insurance i'm going to put like 100 uh you said it's in mint condition right it's in a really good condition it's in mint condition i mean by that i mean is it's going to go to be a rental maybe spend five six thousand bucks eight thousand that's max 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 yeah just maybe you have to, because again you have to refi the house so you need to at least paint it make it nicer right. cleaner so you get the uh, get a good uh, appraisal, uh, so that you can get most of your money out uh, after the thing. So, should I put like ten thousand just on safe side? Yeah, ten is good. Yeah. Um, okay, and then um, let me go through utilities. Commission cost is nothing. Um, Well, I'm coming up with a very high number. Um, right. So, but in that area, I mean, so you would like to keep the, see my max offer when I do it, do it on calculator the way we do it, uh, it's right. because of the repair cost are low and the equity is high, it's actually giving me a very high number of like 136,000. Right. So but Correct. that doesn't make sense for a rental. So uh, for 10,000 uh, and other costs, about 515 so yeah 97 100 will be the max okay uh, all right so i'm gonna go with 100 and then i got like a minute and a half more here before uh i need to put in for the other one the other one in bolingbroke i went and talked to the lady um uh, and uh, nice lady hispanic lady and she says that uh, you know she's okay moving out um the house is an odd looking house um i sent you a couple of the pictures on the outside of the house uh, yeah, but so probably he's going to need 25 in work. So what do you think there? Okay, but 
it will be same property right almost similar number there in that area bowling yeah, 160 much, yeah, i think maybe a little less though 155 maybe. Um, and then uh, in that area the, the taxes are same little high um, mm -hmm. repair cost is if it's a big house i'm just going to put like just to be on safer side uh, 35,000 to just do everything so that's coming right on 100,000 mark okay so basically max uh, uh, about 100 on yes. that one also well with the commission on that maybe 90, uh, 95 should be max okay max 90 okay max 95 on that one okay I'm gonna go ahead and put it in um, and let's see I'm gonna wait for um, you know uh, here for another 30 seconds I just need to let her know all right okay talk to you okay bye, bye. So, okay, so our number uh, on both the properties is kind of around that 100,000 number. So uh, I'm going to put it in in a few minutes. We'll see what exactly happens as the auction starts and as people start bidding up. So we'll see.